Well, Pebbles. Good name, I think. Well, very kind of the lady here to let me stay over. Also had some stew for breakfast. And now I'm ready to head out to find, uh, find Ginger. Okay, Pebbles. Ugh. Let's do this, shall we? Apparently if we head south, find the river and head towards Rate, we should find some charcoal burners. See how we go. To make sure I look where I'm going, I'm not <laughs> completely uh, confident riding horses just yet. Hello, good morning, sir! Still a little bit strange. Sun's beginning to rise. I don't have, well, I mean, I gotta say, I don't have time to take in the sights, but really? <laughs> I mean, I've slept for a good five hours, so what's an extra five minutes? Yeah, the, uh, s s I suppose the s smoke billowing into the sky kind of ruins the, ruins the mood. <laughs> See how this is going to work. Ah, excellent. Okay, take it steady. So here's uh, the stream, which should lead to a uh, lead to the river. There's a slightly better view, without the smoke. How nice. Hey, wait a minute. So here's a river, so we need to be following the river down this way. Now who the, who's that, I wonder? Okay. Okay, Pebbles. Take it. Take it steady. There's a good boy. There we go. Ah, just a random traveller on the road, I think. Certainly doesn't look like Ginger. Nor a charcoal burner, to be honest. Let's go. Whoa, whoa, steady, steady, steady. Not too fast. Just keep following the river. And there are some <clears throat> buildings over there. I wonder if those are what we're looking for. Okay, just turn down here. And once again, Pebbles, just take it nice and steady. Okay, steady boy, steady. There we go. Oh! oh. OK. 
Okay, there's quite a few buildings here. That one's got smoke coming out of it. Let's, uh, let's try this one. Hopefully it's good smoke and not bad smoke. Hey, some kind of camp. Can this be the charcoal burners? I'm seeing lots of wood. Yeah, this could be promising. Okay, Pebbles, you stay right there. Enjoy this lovely grass. Good morning. May I have a word? God be with you. Could you help me? Depends what you want, doesn't it? I'm looking for Ginger, a stable boy from Neuhof. They say he ran away and joined up with some charcoal burners he used to hang around with sometimes. Sorry, there's never been a lad called Ginger around here. You have to try somewhere else. A murder's been committed at Neuhof, and that boy likely knows who did it. It's vital I find him. There's been murder aplenty in these parts of late, but that Ginger lad really hasn't been here. There'll be a lot less murdering going on once I bring those bastards to justice. So how about helping me out? Calm down, lad. For the love of God. There's been no one like the boy you want round here. But then again, there are other charcoal burners. Try them. You might want to hurry. You're not the first to be asking about him. And the others weren't exactly a noble-looking bunch. Although they were generous with their silver. They didn't happen to say what they wanted him for? No. But they definitely didn't look like they wanted to invite him to a feast. Do you have any idea where else he could have gone? You said he was friends with the charcoal burners? Well, you'll definitely find some in the forest between Neuhof and Ujets. There's good spots around there. But that forest is huge. I could spend weeks searching. Then follow the river. That's how you found us, isn't it? Where there's charcoal burners, there's always water nearby. All right. I'll go and ask somewhere else. Farewell. Oh, Alright, finally got the uh, information out of him after a little bit of coercion. Good day to you. I'm looking for a stable boy from Neuhof. Then why aren't you looking for him at the stud farm? Because he fled from there and supposedly went to see some charcoal burners. Well, he didn't come here. You'll have to try elsewhere. God be with you. Okay, maybe they're telling the truth. Okay, let me just sit here and uh, get my map out. <sighs> okay, so the forest... Did he say the forest between uh, Ushits? Is that what he said? Gotta be the forest north of Neuhof he's talking about. In fact, let me zoom this. Let me get my. Hmm. That's not too far from here. And we're set off early, so we still have plenty of light. I think we need to go straight there now. If he's been already asked after, it's not a good sign. Certainly can't afford to waste time. Okay. What do I have in my pack food-wise? Nothing. 
Well, if we're off into the forest, we can always find ourselves a hare. Okay. All right, Pebbles, we're off again. To the north this time. Let's go. So back the way we came, past Neuhof to the north. Turn towards the east, northeast. We should be okay. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, go, there we go. Hey, see, he's getting used to it. Don't worry, pebbles. Me and you, we're going to be together for a long time, I have a feeling. We'll soon get to know each other's quirks and foibles. Did we come this way? I kind of lost my... I think I've lost my track. Maybe we could just... We should really be following the smoke, I suppose. Hang on a second. Is this a bridge? No, but it's a good place to cross. Come on then, Pebbles, let's do this one again. Come on, come on. Oh! Hey, oh. There we go. We'll take this one off the uh, off the beaten track. Ah, this looks a bit better, a bit more promising. I remember this building. We went down here. Got there in the end. Oh, way! Head north past Neuhof. And then to the north northwest, I think I said northeast there. They get my my east and my west mixed up. Hmm, this could make sense because that was the direction that they ran off towards. When they left the farm. Hmm. So in that case. Yeah. Cutting through these woods leads to this path here, or this road here. Go this way. Oh my god. <laughs> For one brief moment I thought that was a char char grilled person. Oh my god. I'm feeling a little bit uneasy out here. I feel very exposed. Morning! Have a good day. Okay. Well, 
we are in a forested area. Don't think we are far west enough yet, but it's a start. Maybe this path will loop round. If we do find the uh, the river or stream of water, oh, ho, ho, ho! What the hell? Hello? What are you doing here? Why do you ask? Can I not take a walk in the woods without being accosted? I ask because I'm the gamekeeper here, and it's my job to protect these woods from poachers. Well, I'm certainly not poaching. In that case, you won't mind if I have a look what you've got on you. Feel free. Certainly. Go ahead and look. Mm. All right. Nothing suspicious here. You may leave, Goodman. Thank you. Oh, good to see they're on the ball, hey? Is that his tent? That looks rather menacing. Uh, the path seems to end here. Well, in that case, I'm going to head off the path in the direction where I think I need to go. Oh, it's a good job I didn't, cap good job I didn't uh, get myself a, a hare ready to cook for lunch, isn't it? Look, I'm doing Sir Ranzig's work here. And if I need to eat to keep my strength up, I'm sure they wouldn't mind. Oh my god, I think I think I'm I think I'm lost. God, there could be there could be Coomans here waiting. Bandits. This is not a good place to be. Once I have found this ginger, I will take him back. To see justice and then that's it I'm gonna be spending the next few days pebbles training hopefully with Captain Bernard because so far other than that one session we've had all the training that I've had is facing life and death situations and that is no place to train I could have been killed if it wasn't for that guy that came to my rescue yesterday trying to f I need to find either a path or some water ah, we're coming into a clearing here this this looks promising for any sign of movement really any sign of movement and we are out of here ah, look at this and this I can finally get my eyeball on the situation let's just see what we can find here to find water. Hey, hang on. Hey. 
Hey. Are these charcoal burners? Have we just got lucky here? I think we might have done pebbles. Not a splash of water to be seen, but here we are, I think. Pebbles. Okay, you know what to do? I'll be back. Hey there! Jesus Christ be praised. Has anyone here seen Ginger? That boy from the stud farm? Yes, that's the one. Is he around? No, he's not here. But he passed through not long ago on the way to Tarnburg. You follow the stream to the west and you'll find more charcoal burners there. Farewell. Oh my god, you have got to be kidding me. Excuse me, on my map, can you point to where the stream is? I am a little bit confused. Oh! No bother, I found it. Thank you. Looks like we weren't quite so lucky, Pebbles. But uh, we know where we're going. Unless we're being sent on a bloody goose chase. Should I check with one other person to make sure? I mean, he sounded like he was being honest. Well... I can't see why he would lie. Right. Well, the stream to the west. And uh, we should find ourselves another camp of charcoal burners. Wait a second. This looks familiar. Isn't this where we went hunting with some hands? familiar well at least I know where to come if I need uh, to get my head down and of course if I need a bite to eat okay it's handy right Okay, Pebble, let's get ourselves back onto the pathway here and let's find these blooming charcoal burners. Ah, sorry, boy. I'm not taking you in the best way, am I? But eh, it's good practice. Sometimes we may be required to take ground that isn't quite so, quite so steady in an emergency, you know? Best to get our practice in now, else there's no pressure. <sighs> well, I gotta say, oh, I was, <laughs> I was gonna say that it was—it's quite nice to be able to enjoy the day whilst on official business. And before I got a chance to open my mouth, it starts to rain. 
How fantastic. Well, thankfully, we might get a bit of shelter on the trees. Kind of. Come on, pebbles. The faster we move... The faster we move, it makes no difference. <laughs> but at least I can feel like I'm dodging the rain. This pebbles, look at this. This looks like another charcoal burner's place. Yes, come on. Now, if these people tell me uh, to go somewhere else, I lose my patience. Right, Pebbles, I'll be back. That's this fella. Hello there! Christ be praised. Good health to you, sir. I'm looking for a boy called Ginger from Neuhof. You don't happen to know anything about him. What is it to you? He's suspected of a murder, so I need to ask him a few questions. Or take him away to jail. Well, if you need to find him so badly, I suppose I could get a reward, couldn't I? I'm investigating a crime, not bartering for a chicken. Well then, I'm sure you've got some silver on you. Just give it to me, and it'll be a done deal. And what if I bashed your face in and had you dragged off to the stocks in Ratai? No need for that. All I wanted was a bit of silver, and instead I get the whip. Spit it out, will you? Well, fine. I've heard that they're hiding him in some remote cottage at the edge of the forest on the way to Ujits. That didn't hurt too much now, did it? Farewell. Now, if you wouldn't mind pointing approximately where it is on my map, I would be very grateful. It's still raining. Okay, well, thank you for the information. Apparently not too far from here, this hut. Come on, boy. I'm not taking you the best way here, am I? What did I say about practice? Oh, boy. Practice or broken legs? There is actually a road here. Huh. Interesting. Just like testing you, uh, pebbles. Now, apparently, we should be near it. Keep our eye out for a building, a hut, something. worse looking for this blasted hut or trying to find Sir Hans after he ran off and left me. Oh, God, I'm 
getting a bit peckish here. Who said working for Sir Radzig was going to be all action, adventure and excitement, eh? I'd love to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Alright, we'll walk around for a little bit longer. And then uh, I'm going to have to nab myself something. Oh! Hang on. What's this? Hot. <gasps> Ginger! Jesus, you've led me a merry dance. What do you want from me? I want to ask you a couple of questions. Why did you run off like that? Where are your cronies? And why did you kill that bandit? What? Right, one thing at a time. Why did you run off in such a hurry? Because I was afraid they'd come back and kill me. Who? Those, those bandits, of course. To get revenge on you for killing their mate? Killing? Me? I... I never killed anyone. God is my witness. I'm looking for your friends. Where are they? The charcoal burners? They're over at the... To hell with the charcoal burners. Where are your bandit mates? The, they're not my mates. They, they nearly killed me. I recognized one of them, so I thought they'd come back and... Recognized? Who was it? Talk! I d don't know his n name, only that he's from Ushets and he has a limp. What can you tell me about him? How do you know him? I saw him a few times in the tavern in Ushets, playing dice and boozing. And? I know he lives in a house on the edge of the village, but that's all I know. I never talked to him. Why did you kill that bandit? What? Bandit? I never killed anyone. This is yours, isn't it? I pulled it from the belly of a dead bandit near the stud farm. That is mine, but I didn't stab him. That fellow took it from me. What fellow? I don't know his name, but he's from Ujits, and he has a limp. He limps, and he's from Ujits. That's not much to go on, but I suppose it'll have to do. It's all I know. I never talked to him. And now tell me exactly what happened. And don't leave anything out. That's quite a long story. Don't worry, I'm going to get bored. All right. I woke up in the middle of the night because I needed to go for a piss. So I went out into the dark, same as usual, only... Only there was something there that shouldn't have been. At first I thought it was just a trick of the light, but it wasn't. And then it was too late. They went past and I thought they must be horse thieves. I would have yelled, only I was afraid they'd kill me. So I waited until they were out of sight, and I started to sneak away, but then... Then the slaughtering started. Yes. I, I thought they'd steal the horses and ride off. That would be bad enough, but then all the killing started and flames everywhere. And, uh, it was terrible, like hell itself. And then? It, it seemed some of them didn't like it either. They started squabbling among themselves, and some of them started running back where they came from, right towards me. And I had that thing in my hand, the hoof pick. So you stabbed the first one in the belly? No, no. He ran right into me. He was running fast for a fellow with a limp. He pushed me aside and I fell on the ground. Then he told me I'd better lie low if I valued my life. And he ran off with the others. And I, I did what he said and hid. Then the rest of the gang ran past. And then? And then I waited in case that limping one from Ushitz came back. I didn't dare come out until I was sure. 
I think it was almost light. What about the others? Was there anything you noticed about them? Uh, I don't know. There, there might have been maybe eight of them, and two of them were really big. That's all I can remember. Do you know what they argued about? I didn't hear everything, but I reckon some of them were only there to steal and wanted no part in the killing. That's all. I've heard everything I need to hear, so I'll leave you be. Wait! What about me? Won't you help me out? Uh, perhaps I could. What would you like? I'd like to go back to the stud farm, but those cutthroats who want to kill me are still around. Will you help me? It's all over with them. You've uh, nothing more to fear. Really? God bless you. But there's just one thing. What? I'm afraid to go back to the farm. I, I ran away, and God knows what they'll think about it all. I don't know if they'll even want to talk to me. Just try, and you'll see whether they drive you away or not. But if you explain it to them, they're sure to understand. I suppose you're right. Thank you for your help, and God bless you. <sighs> help him. Well, abandoned sound force to be nearby. It'll be fine. Right, I think I need to get back to speak with uh, Captain Bernard. I wonder if he's still at Neuhof. Suppose there's only one way to find out. If I can get back there, it'll be uh, it'll be handy, Pebbles, because I need something to eat. Yeah. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, Pebbles, Pebbles, what you? How you doing? God, trying to get me killed here. Take it steady. Take it steady. To find that pathway again. Ginger was walking up the other way. If he wants to go back to Neuhof, I should be coming this way. Ah, I see the path, I see it. I see it in the distance. Right, as soon as we hit that pebbles, we are going flat out back. Whoa, 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 whoa. Flat out back to Neuhof. To be quite honest with you, I'm actually hoping Captain Bernard is back in Rete. I don't fancy heading to Ujritz, confronting those people until I've had some training. They're going to be tough nuts to crack if we get into uh, any sort of combat. But let's see what Captain Bernard says first. Right, come on, now's the time for you to move yourself, Pebbles! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, look out! Oh my god! I went a different way. I don't want to fancy going the same way that I came <laughs> through the woods. Try and see if I can yeah. make my way back along the pathway here. Look out! Look out! Oh, 
My God. Oh. Yeah. Come on, let's go. Where's Neuhoff? Yeah. Should be down that way. Yeah. For the signs of the smoke. Where is it? Yeah. I don't know, maybe the rings put the fire out, eh? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my belly is churning. Turn! Yeah, look at that. The smoke has dissipated. What a day! Hey! Is that Sir Radzig's horse? He's here! Razzig. God bless you. What troubles you? My lord, I managed to find a clue to the whereabouts of the bandits. Excellent. Bernard already told me what's been happening, but I'd like to hear it straight from the horse's mouth. The whole story, or just the gist of it, sir? It's up to you what you consider important. One of the Neuhoff stable boys, a, a lad they call Ginger, fled from there and hid out with some charcoal burners. I have to say, there's a lot of them around. I never thought how many forges and ironworks they have to supply. That's true, but keep to the point. Oh, yes, sir. I had quite a job finding him. He was well hidden and with good reason. The bandits wanted to kill him because he recognized one of them. Did he tell you what happened? He said it wasn't one gang, but two. And one of them took fright when the slaughter started. Seems they were only interested in loot, so they quarreled with the other lot. Then it came to a skirmish in the woods, and one of them was killed. And the rest of them scattered. And did you find out where they went? All I know is one of them is from Ujits. I know enough about him to be able to track him down. All right, but those cutthroats must know who he is too, right? And if they want to get revenge on him or silence him, you'd better hope they don't get to him before you. So drop everything and get on his trail. Find out what he knows, and then report back to me. I'm going to our encampment of Merhaya to oversee the security of the region. Yes, sir. <sighs> he told me to go urgently. <sighs> but I want to train. Captain Bernard. Jesus Christ be praised. I'll be with you. He must be going back to uh, Torette. What do I do? I think I'm going to have to go to Ujits. But not before I've had a bite to eat. Well, what? I think uh, it's time to head back to Retai. Maybe one training session? Something to eat? Back to the mill see Teresa. Get a little bit of rest and then uh, tomorrow bright and early? Head out to Ushitz. <sighs> Can't even pause to take breath it seems. I gotta do what my lord commands.
Right, Pebbles, we're going again. It's time for you to stretch your legs, because I am hungry. Let's go!